got a nice uh, three compartment up here as well as a cooler under that seat. Take a look. Nice uh, big cooler with the drain. And then down here in the floor we have a huge fish box. It goes all the way up front. And then we've got these two lockers here that have drains as well. Very large. And then put those down. Very nice all stainless steel hardware. Gas assisted shocks on all the hatches. Uh, up here we have our rope anchor locker and we've got a nice anchor in there with very clean rope got your nav lights you got uh, stainless steel six inch cleats and then looking back we have a forward facing spreader light we got two speakers up here very nice hard top Okay, and here's our seating position, our helm, stainless steel wheel, and a Garmin 541 GPS map, it's a chart plotter, fish finder, GPS, a Richie 3 inch compass, got our Honda digital tachometer and digital speed, multifunction gauges, and then on our switches we've got courtesy lights, cabin lights, anchor light, bilge, water pressure, wash down, live well, two accessories and a horn and a 12 volt. And then we've got our uh, Honda throttle here, Honda on off switch with uh, engine lights. And we've got all pressure, all temperature, voltage and check engine. Okay, and up top in the electronics box we have a uh, standard Horizon Eclipse DSC Plus. And then we have our uh, stereo and CD player as well. Can you see that? There you go. Real deep uh, locker uh, electronics box. I'm going to drop that down. And that is a nice uh, acrylic waterproof box. And we got switches up top as well. Forward spreader lights, aft spreader lights, courtesy lights, 12 volt. We got VHF and radio. And room for two more accessories. So let me let you look at this T top. Okay, really nice. You've got four rocket launchers and some more spreader lights. Uh, self contained unit there, really nice. And then the leaning post, uh, you've got four more rocket launchers. You've got a live well bait well back there. You've got uh, side gunnels with storage for eight rods or nets or gaffs. On, on uh, each side, you have that. You got a nice transom door here and then uh, in the back we have a conversion of a uh, transom access a leaning post with a combing pad or a bench seat really nice so we'll do all three uh, here's one battery over here so you get two batteries uh, one crank one house I guess so you can run them together right there with your battery switch there's your water pressure um, and then uh, really clean bilge underneath there. All right, so let me lower this. Really nice. All right, so now you've got uh, a cockpit fishing platform. And then the third configuration, and I'm doing this all with one hand. There it is. And there's a the bench seat. So that is really nice. Easy to do, too. All right, let me show you inside the center console, uh, which is a huge compartment in here. And you've got plenty of room for a porta potty in there. And then you've got your uh, electronics panel access there. This does have a light, uh, a lot of room, very nice. All right, we'll be right back. All right, there's your cockpit fishing area. There's our Honda 225 four-stroke. Got less than 100 hours on it. Boat is in excellent condition. There's our hard top, got VHF antenna, anchor light. Beautiful boat. We'll take a look at the outside next. 
All right, here we are on the outside. Here's a Honda 225 VTEC four stroke fuel inject. Got a triple blade Mirage Plus. Very nice double axle all aluminum trailer. Go over here. Boat is in great shape. Ready to fish. All offers are welcome.